In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to make the native Apple calendar, the iCal, work with Plan Plus online. So this is actually a two-step process. The first thing you're going to need to do is publish your Plan Plus iCal feed and consume that or subscribe to that inside of your iCal. Then the second step will be to publish the iCal feed and then to configure Plan Plus to consume that. So let's go into Plan Plus and we'll publish the Plan Plus iCal feed first. Okay, so here we are inside our Plan Plus account. We see that we've got appointments on our calendar. Click on Preferences and then go to Calendar Task. And you'll see where it says Calendar iCal feed URL. Click the download link and it will give you a URL that you can copy. And then go into your Mac calendar, your iCal and up here under the file option you'll see an option for new calendar subscription so click on that and then you just paste that link in and you can give it a name and you can choose how often you want it to auto refresh I would probably recommend you do it maybe once a day there's no need to do it every five minutes but maybe once a day should work So now that calendar will show up here under my other calendars. You can see these are my appointments that I have coming over from that calendar. So that is the first step. What we've done there is we've done step one. We've published our Plan Plus iCal feed and we've created a subscription to it in iCal. So the next step, we want to take our iCal appointments and make them available in Plan Plus. So to do that, I've identified this calendar right here called Mac Calendar and I want to make that available in Plan Plus. So I click this little icon right here and I'm going to make that a public calendar and it is going to allow me to email the link and you can either email it to yourself or you can just copy the link. I just want to copy the link for my purposes and then I'll go into my Plan Plus account. If you're on this screen still, you can just hit the back button. And what you want to do before you, it, you're going to be on the calendar pages where you're going to set that up. But if you, if you just see a blank spot right here, it means that you need to turn this feature on. So to turn the feature on, you'll go back to the Preferences link, click on Calendar, and you'll want to say Display External iCalendar appointment. appointment. Change that to Yes, click Submit, and then you'll go back to your calendar tab and here you will be able to paste that calendar feed in you can select a color for those appointments let's say I want them to be pink okay so I paste that in here I click submit and it tells me that I've got a couple of events that have been processed so I go back to my calendar and you'll notice that I can click on the edit link there and I can give it a name and there's the appointments for my Mac that are showing up in Plan Plus so because this appointment is just reading a it's a read-only feed so I can't edit that appointment from Plan Plus uh, because it's an appointment on my Mac now I can edit my Plan Plus appointments on Plan Plus I can't edit my Mac appointments now when I go into my iCal same thing applies I can open up my Mac appointments but my appointments from my Plan Plus on calendar are just read only so that will allow you to integrate your two calendars from your Mac and your Plan Plus and it's a two-step process thank you